Hey guys, how y'all doing? And welcome to another dark and gloomy day in Washington State. But that's okay because today we're trying out Sandmark's all new uh, microscope lens. And as you can see, it has a light built in, so no sunlight needed. Um, this thing's pretty cool. You can take uh, you can take photographs all the way down, you know, to the microscopic level. And I've been playing around with it. I've got a fern leaf set up over here, um, and I'm basically I just kind of set this lens on top of it, kind of moved across it, and and I was able to take video with this lens too. Um, yeah, so let me show, I'll bring you guys over here and show you uh, exactly how cool this lens actually is. So this is what the front side looks like, and we are going to take this all the way down to 40 times magnification with this microscope lens. And the uh, the back side is actually a little more interesting than the front. It's got these spore sacs all over it, and this is actually how uh, ferns reproduce. They reproduce by dropping these spore sacs on the on the ground, or you know they could blow away on a windy day, and that's actually how ferns are made. They're they're kind of like mushrooms, you know. They just they they they, they release spore sacs, and that's how they reproduce. And uh, so this is the the front side of the fern and I can already see this doesn't look anything like it looked before we zoomed in on it this looks like a completely different plant to me at the microscopic level guys just you know I'm sorry this is just a, a hair out of focus too and that's because you know mostly because I'm moving and that sound you're hearing right now is actually caused by the microscope just kind of dragging across the leaf and across the stems and I'm going to take a photograph real quick here just so we can see what it looks like at the photographic level all right, so this is what my uh, photograph after actually looked like, and this is the first photograph that I have ever taken with this microscope lens. All right, now let's zoom back in again and have a look at these. Wait a minute. Yeah, what is that? Wow. Boy, he's ugly. He's tiny, too. You know, he's, uh, like I said, we're down at the microscopic level. You can't really see that guy with the naked eye at all. He would be invisible without this microscope. And those spore sacs that, that he's climbing on, they kind of look like worms to me. I know this is a plant, they can't, they can't be worms, but <laughs> yeah, I, I've never seen a, a spore sac under a microscope lens before. Look at this, guys. These things are crazy looking. <laughs> wow, yeah, this is just like a whole new universe in here. I'm really excited. Um, look at this, about this new lens. <laughs> This is exciting. Yeah, this plant doesn't look anything like this at all when you're just looking at it. It only looks like this at the microscopic level. You can see these spores are lined up on the back of every leaf in rows. There are basically there's two rows on the back of every single leaf. And I'm going to go ahead and get a photograph of this one too to see what this one looks like at the, the microscopic level. Well, those look like little tiny cobwebs connecting those spores together. I'm not sure if that is what that is or not, but man, this microscope lens is taking things to the next level, guys. This is pretty amazing. Okay, I hope you found this demonstration of Sandmark's uh, microscope lens helpful. I know I'm very glad that I've added this to my collection, and thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next week. <laughs>